Today is about keeping things loose. <laughs> Perfect. And remembering the journey is just as important as the destination. Oh my goodness. Woo! Easy breezy. We're wasting no time framing the second story. It's like a pergola in here. We could have some grapes, some flowers, a vine. A snowman. A snowman, no snowman, no snowman. I'm too soon for snowman. And embracing all the helpful changes. You look like a train conductor. <laughs> Bathroom artwork is here to stay. I'm very excited. We are waking up to a fall morning. It's a beautiful morning. It's sunny with no chance of rain, <sighs> but it's cold. I'm breaking out my fall attire and I am not complaining about it. I could take you back to my youth and show you what I wish I knew. My will is strong with a place to lean. In the moment I hung best belief, the other ring of my wrist is gold. Pairing with the light it holds. When I return from my spinning bone, I'm remembering the words you told. I'm super excited to hang those photos later today, but in the meantime, there's so much happening this morning. We are back to work, and these guys have a lot planned for today. Ooh, look at this. this past weekend, we had the first real event of the season with an actual accumulation of snow. Not at our property, but at properties very close by and at some ski resorts nearby, which is a little bit intimidating. But it's nice today, so we're taking advantage of that. It is beautiful out here. I'm about to take my hoodie off. We are gonna start rolling joists. However, BMC brought us the wrong hangers. So mm. Allie is gonna run to BMC, exchange those hangers for the correct hangers so that we can finish doing these joists. And then hopefully by the time she gets back, We'll be ready to put all the rest of the joists in and start putting the floor down. All right. All right, well, Allie runs to BMC. We are gonna get going here. We have one large beam that we need to put in, one very small beam, and then we just need to start rolling our joists. There is gonna be a point where we can't continue with the joists until we have the hangers that Allie is coming back with, but I think this could go relatively quickly. We could have all the joists rolled in probably by noon or maybe one o'clock, and then we'll have the rest of the day to get all the sheets put on for the floor sheeting, and then we'll have a second story floor. That will be very, very exciting. Wow, guys, I was gone for like 45 minutes. 
It's like a pergola in here. We could have some grapes, some flowers, a vine. A snowman, no snowman, no snowman. I'm too soon for snowman. <laughs> We're making a lot of progress. We got our short little beam that spans the hallway over there. We got our beam right here that uh, is the load bearing beam that's gonna transfer all of the weight from the roof down through this load bearing wall, down to the pylons and the footings and the posts in the basement, in the crawl space, bottom attic, whatever you wanna call it. And uh, we have, I think like 12 joists left. And then we've gotta do the hangers and some stuff over there block both ends hmm. and we can start throwing down floor sheathing. That's insane. Yeah, we're making huge progress. Wow. It's a nice, beautiful, warm, sunny day. Doesn't feel like winter at all out here. Yeah. Happy. I'm a happy boy. I'm happy you're a happy boy. I'm a little nervous because you know what comes after floors? Well, I don't know, maybe you do walls first, but eventually, stairs. <laughs> stairs are not gonna happen until like January. Perfect, okay, good. <laughs> Stairs is gonna be a fun day. <laughs> He's throwing with his left hand. Who knows? One of the nice unexpected perks of all this excavation and regrading is we literally have like pathways and little walking trails across our property now. It'll be nice to kind of like continue to tamp these down and use them for little like bike paths for Leo or little walking trails for Leo. They're not very big, but it's better than it being like really steep and rocky with huge bushes, which is what it was before. We're kind of just like turning it into a more usable part of the property. And Leo and Jennifer are on a little walkabout right now. <laughs> So because they didn't have the right hangers this morning, they went ahead and installed all of the joists and now we are going to retroactively install all of the hangers, glue and nail them in place under each joist. What? How weird is it to do that in that order? It's not weird. It's okay? Yeah. Hello. No. What happened? What's I'm seriously not opposed to all of us switching over to snowboard goggles airtight goggles Fantastic or just like idea. swimming goggles can you imagine that <laughs> with the, nose, <laughs> the nose thing and the head thing a water a, a swimming snorkel. cap a snorkel yeah oh just a snap i guess i could grab it with my key yeah come on Go good bees think my hair is like some type of tropical flower or something because like when it gets all wispy and it's all hanging out the bees and the wasps and stuff are always flying up in it you smell sweet I smell like crap <laughs> guarantee I smell like onions right now <laughs> not showered this morning never shower in the morning I'm sweaty 
Who knows how dirty my clothes are? Bees love it for some reason. Not smell good. Success. Captured in a photograph. Remember how he used to sit in the lines. Yeah. Oh. I can hear you laugh it off. You always said mistakes I left in the past. I found it. Is that a forklift? Forklift. You want lotion on your nose? Yes or no? Okay, take your thumb out. There you go. Yummy. <gasps> you got lotion on your nose, yeah. you silly boy. Ha. A camera? Ha. You see a camera? Can you show me how you wave? Can we wave with both hands? Hi. Both hands. Ready? One, two, three. <gasps> Hi. <laughs> All right, so I'm almost done rolling joists. I've still got to nail the end of the last piece, and then we've got to do our blocking. So we're making some progress here. Things are going really well. I couldn't be happier. Wanna move my feet. Wanna drink my wine. Wanna move my feet. Wanna drink my wine. You know that time of year where you wake up and you're like, it's fall, I'm gonna get on all my fall clothes. And by like afternoon time, you're just dying because it's so hot. It's not actually fall yet. That's exactly how I feel right now. last hanger that we're trying to put on right now and that will be all of the hangers and beams and TJIs then we just have to do the blocking which will probably take the rest of the day but we're gonna try and do it quickly cool. Like an auctioneer. Huh? Brandon sounds like an auctioneer. Do I hear a fifteen? No fifteen. <laughs> no fifteen. No. <laughs> convenient road back here to pull all of the sheathing up to. Look how perfect that is. Where does he want to put it? I was thinking on this corner. Unfortunately, all of the blocking and rolling all of the joists ended up taking the entire day. We've got all the joists, all the rim board, all the hangers, all the beams, all the blocking. Everything is completely done, which means first thing in the morning, we're going to start slapping these sheets up, gluing them and nailing them down. By the end of the day tomorrow, we'll at least have a floor and maybe we'll be starting to build some walls. Very cool. Yeah.
we are waking up to installing the second story, day two, and things are already moving really quickly. What's up guys and good morning. We are out here getting ready to get started for the day. We've got the skid steer, lifted up all of our sheets of flooring, which is an absolute godsend. Having to like shimmy those things up to the second story is not fun. So I'm very glad that we have this thing to just lift them up for us. We can slide them right off. We're gonna start gluing joists and getting this floor nailed in. Look at you and your suspenders. Like that. Keeping your pants up. That's right. One day at a time. Good dog. Good dog. Yesterday everything was fully prepped, the rim board is done, all the joists have been rolled, the blocking is fully done, layout is done, they snapped their first line. We are about to install the very first flooring sheet on the second story. Moving and grooving over here. Looking good. It's actually going pretty quick. Yeah. It's 10:45. We've got uh, almost two complete rows of sheathing down, of floor sheathing down, and I think we have five rows. So we're like 40% of the way there. Cool. Going pretty quick. We might actually start framing walls today. That's exciting. Hello, guys. How do you do? That work. I'm writing you a letter. I hope it reaches you. I'm not even up on the roof, or it feels like a roof, but it's actually a floor. I'm not even up on the floor right now, and I am hot. Fall is, uh, is tricky. It's cold in the mornings. It's hot in the afternoons. I think everyone is probably in need of a little snack break. All right, you guys. Grapes, peanut butter pretzels, sweet snacks. Perfect. That was like a real snack. It's basically a Leo snack, but I know these guys will appreciate it too.
the last piece of our floor up here. Basically just have to nail this on, make one more little cut right here. One more cut over there. And we're ready to start uh, building walls or at least getting our studs up here and laying walls out. Wow. Very exciting. Look like your grandpa I feel like my grandpa. <laughs> I was gonna say he looks like you. <laughs> they do work pretty good. Good. Somebody sent these to me. Yeah. They're really nice. They sent me some like Santa Claus ones too. You'll have to break those out pretty soon. But, and this has been like amazing all day. You look like a train conductor. <laughs> I'll go ahead and take this down and put it in the trailer. And if you guys want to go out, I think there's 10 foot and 16 foot two by sixes out there. Build some walls. Let's build some walls. over for a long time then you try to stand up and it's like oh couple of things working for us here. One, there's no sheathing on here. Two, it's only a seven foot wall. It just has that one header in there, so it's not gonna be super heavy. The problem is we can't stand in the, the stair space over here. So I'll be on the end over here because obviously <laughs> I'm, you know, super strong. I'm gonna lift all of that and then you three will line up over here. It's all toenailed down, so it should just pivot on those toenails and stand straight up. Um, in the freak incident that the toenails let go and it starts sliding, just let it go. If you try to hold on to it, it'll just take you with it and Grayson's the only one that would survive that. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> and then once we stand it up, just hold it there and I'll nail the bottom plate. Ready? Ready? Break! Break. almost your shoulder and the window opening will probably be like here yeah, you're look at probably. that but it's good enough that you can really see out I Full thought it was gonna coverage. be like this thing up here where you like all you can see is the sky <laughs> this is like in case there's a fire fires blocking the door in the bathroom you have to run and like take one step off the tub and <laughs> dive straight through the window because this one doesn't open you would not you might have to dive face first <laughs> That forehead break. You better throw a rock first because you are not breaking that window with your yeah. forehead. That's very true. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> but yeah, this is, uh, I guess, revealing a little bit more of our layout. Um, we're in a large bathroom and this wall right here is going to be the beginning of the closet and it comes over to like here. So we have 
we compensated because most people noticed that when we built the original house, we made no closets, zero closets in the entire house. So this master bedroom has a nice big walk-in master closet. And then in the master bath here, we're gonna have a tub, there's gonna be a shower, there's gonna be a his and her sink, and then there's gonna be like a little closet with a toilet in it, which I'm very excited for so that we can contain the stink. That stink. It's not, it's not just for me. <laughs> Everybody. Anyway, we have this little window here. This window is actually going to be right above the bathtub. It's the only window in the bathroom. And then right about here is the end of the bathroom. Mm -hmm. And then everything this direction is the master bedroom. Uh, a lot of the area that's over there actually gets taken up by like the door and the top of the stairs and stuff. So our bedroom now is actually about the exact same size as our bedroom that we already have. It's just that this one will have walls and a door. It's a huge upgrade. It's a huge upgrade. <laughs> and then our current bedroom is going to become kind of like a playroom and guest room area, which is also going to be great. Oh my goodness. Woo! Easy breezy. <laughs> We got a wall stood, we got the floor completely installed, and I think before we call it a day, we gotta do one thing, and that's, uh, we gotta do some mail time. So we've got a couple of packages here. I love mail time. Enjoy your gift from Arthur. Some plum bobs. <laughs> some twine and some plum bobs. These that's are coming awesome. really handy. Thank you so much, Arthur. That's a great gift. That's a great gift. I hope I'm not being too presumptuous, but thought maybe Leo would enjoy learning with these talking cards. Love that little guy, and of course you guys too. I'm an old PCer, 80s, 90s, from Vicky. Aww. Oh, cute. Nice. It's one of the little things that you like stick the card in and it like tells you what it is. Oh, cool. Oh, Leo's this gonna awesome. love that. Leo will love this, thank you. And this one is from Sue. Oh, this one's called Fat Bob learns to fly. Leo, look. Look what Dada has. Is that a new book for Leo? Oh, yeah. yeah. It's a book? You wanna look at it? Okay, be very gentle with go. it. Wow. Yeah. She was talking about when uh, we had the baby Robin and then it flew away, how oh. that, that experience reminded her of this book. So she got this book and sent it to us. That's so sweet. Thank you, Sue, we appreciate that. It says, this should help so you won't burn any more food on your propane gas cooktop. Oh, okay. Is it a simmerer? A simmerer? Or a simmerer. Oh, cool. It is a simmerer. It's a simmerer rat. <laughs> we do need that. What is this? I don't know, but I'm gonna use it tonight. A simmer grate. Oh, cool. Do you put this on the stove? No, you put it up. You put it like on this. That's the stove. But under the, under this. Under that? Yeah. I don't think so. Okay, we'll look it up. I'm sure there's some instructions right here. This simmer grate came from Joan. So thank you so much, Joan. We're gonna try this out on the stove and we're gonna see how it works. Thank you. Oh, oh no, this last one came from Walmart. We didn't know where this was coming from. So Allie actually already opened it. I don't know what's inside. I'm very excited to find out. <laughs> Just what I always wanted! <laughs> it's a Tonka truck! Look at that! You see this? Whoa. Do you see this? A dump truck for Leo! That's a freaking big truck, dude! Whoa! How much stuff can you put in the back of here? No. Oh, garbage truck fits inside the Tonka truck? Can you dump it out? Lift, push. Oh. Whoa! Dump truck. Do you like yeah. it? <laughs> yeah. Are Leo you going to get in? He's like, no, it's my turn. Uh oh. Oh boy. Oh. Leo's in the dump hang on truck. right here. Leo! Oh. 
Get your garbage truck. Dump truck. There's no note. There's no note? There's no note with this one. If you guys sent us this dump truck or this Tonka truck, thank you so much. There was no note that came with it. So if you guys are watching, thank you. Leo's going to absolutely love this. He already loves it. And I love it too. I love mail time because it just like makes me realize how much people think about us and like how thoughtful people oh. are and they send us really cool stuff. You so. guys are so sweet. Thank, Thank you, you guys so much. so much. I think this is actually where we're going to let you guys go. I know there's been a lot happening and uh, I feel like there's almost a guarantee that we'll finish framing this before winter as long as it doesn't like as long as you don't say guarantee okay <laughs> things are looking good let's just keep it that way but if you guys are enjoying these videos make sure you show us by giving us a big thumbs up on today's video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and let us know in a comment what you guys are enjoying the most seriously thank you guys we love you and we'll see you guys on the next one adios Perfect. Great moves. I don't know. You're one of those dealership balloons. <laughs> the wacky wavy play, inflatable tube man? Yeah. We were young and we were free and running. Never bothered about what could be coming. Every day we danced and life was smiling. We were young and drunk in love.